Now, if you want to warp multiple tracks at the same time, that's completely possible. Maybe you're working on a full song and you need to correct the, all the tracks in the song. First off, all the files have to be the same length. So if they're not the same length, what you want to do, let's just say that this one's here, this one's here. So they're all different lengths, right? Highlight the tracks all the way past the, the longest track. And now that you've done that, what you're gonna do is uh, Command J or con Control J if you're using a PC, and you wanna consolidate all of these tracks. So now that the files are, so the next thing you want to do is choose the tracks that you wanna to warp together. My recommendation is the drum track is gonna be the last track that you wanna choose. Anything that's gonna be easier for you to warp. So let's just say this top one is the one with the most drums. What I would do is I would highlight the first one, hold down Command, select my next one, and then select my drum track last because that's gonna be the one that you're using as a warp reference. Now, obviously this is already warped, but what I can do is as I drop warp markers and move things around, you'll notice that those markers are dropped on every other track as well. So any movements and corrections that you make will be made on all the tracks.